Good morning everybody and once again welcome back in your online maths class. Today I am going to discuss with you about the maths worksheet. So without wasting much time let's get started. So here I am with my maths worksheet. First you have to take your school copy and you have to write CW means classwork. And you have to give the date also. And then for the heading I have written here. What comes after and before. What comes after and before. And here you can see I have drawn some pictures. Okay. First I have drawn ball. Then kite. Mango. Butterfly. Balloon. And bat. And here I have used different types of colors also first i have used blue color then orange and green then here i have used yellow color then here i have used how many color can you tell me yes three colors i have used here blue then purple then orange and here also i have used orange color and here i have used green color here I have drawn one national symbol. So which one? Can you tell me? Yes, mango. Mango is our national fruit. Okay. Then here I have drawn one ball. And the right side I have given one box. So first you have to observe the pictures carefully and you have to read the heading also carefully. After ball, which picture will come here? After ball, kite. So you have to draw here one kite. Then here I have drawn one butterfly in my right side. And left side I have given one box. So, what comes before butterfly? So, which one? Yes, mango will come here. So, you have to draw one mango. Then here I have drawn one mango and the left side I have given one box. So, before mango, which picture will come? Yes, kite. So, you have to draw here one kite. Then here I have drawn one kite and left side I have given one box. So you have to observe which picture will come here. Means which picture will come before kite. Yes, ball. So you have to draw here one ball. Then in my left side I have drawn one butterfly and right side one bat. So what comes between butterfly and bat? In between butterfly and bat, which picture will come? Can you tell me? Yes, balloon will come here. So you have to draw here one balloon. Then I have written here arrange the given number in a sequence arrange the given number in a sequence here i have given three numbers and what you have to do you have to arrange in a sequence means you have to write your first seven then eight nine seven eight nine then here I have written 23, 21 and 22. So here also you have to arrange the number in a sequence. You have to arrange these numbers in a sequence. Means first you have to write 21, then 22 and then 23. And let's move to the next page. For heading here I have written match with correct number match with correct number means 
you can see here I have written some numbers name in my left side and in my right side I have written some numbers so what you have to do you have to match the numbers name with the number by numbering okay by numbering means here you can see I have written A, B, C, D and E. So 3 means A. Understood? 5 means B. 9 means C. 4 means D. And 7 means E. So by numbering you have to matching. Like this. Suppose 3. So you have to search first where is 3 here. So beside 3 you have to write the number A. Okay. So A means 3. Then you have to search where is 5. So here 5. So here you have to write B. In this way you have to match the number names with the number. Okay. Then the next heading I have written. Count and write number and number name. So here how many trees are there? 1, 2, 3. So here you have to write 3 and here you have to write the number's name. Okay. Then here you have to count how many balloons are there. And then first you have to write the number then here you have to write numbers name. Here also first you have to count how many balls are there. And then you have to write here the number. And then you have to write here the numbers name. That's all for today. And I hope you all have enjoyed my this session. And again I will come with my new session, new topic. So thank you for today.